the release regarding the impending AC4, Black Flag is virtually here. Numerous trailers, weaponry, and gameplay attributes have recently been highlighted. During the last several days, I will briefly examine the diverse weapons and game characters within this impressive title. If you've kept up with all of the newest AC4 media reports, then you've possibly already come upon the most recent personas, which are presented, as well as weaponry, like secret blades, flintlock guns, and swords. I'd perhaps like to carry it just one step further and get into a tad more specifics. Regarding these particular weapons, in addition to the figure types, you'll stumble on. Here is a list of the various weapons and personas, which are shown in AC4. Weaponry. Blowtube. The AC collection has just recently unveiled an exciting new weapon to its inventory known as the Blowtube. There are a number of ways of defeating your adversaries when implementing the blowpipe. For example, assuming you are using frantic darts, your adversary will begin to walk around frantically till he inevitably dies. Should you go with venom darts, your competition shall die an awfully slow and painful death. Twin blades. These are going to be one of my absolute favorites, I just know it. Double swords are often used to slice your competition to bits and pieces, in case you're into that sort of thing, just like me. I feel this is remarkably cool. Flinging knives. Instant murders are actually a useful feature while using the flinging knives. Something I suggest you take into account is the immediate death solely work with less strong enemies. In the event you're fighting a much more formidable challenger, it's imperative to toss various knives to finish him. Storyline Characters Edward Kenway He is essentially the principal persona of the whole video game. You are going to be playing as him as you go within the variety of open world stages. Black Bed You are likely to quickly find out that Black Bed is undoubtedly one of the most feared pirates throughout the whole video game. In my opinion he is an awfully great addition to the video game, mainly because of his savage persona and merciless frame of mind. Charles Vane Charles is renowned for being a careless meddler. You know a clash is simply ready to arise whenever he makes his way into the arena. And Bonnie Now here's a really strong chick that conducts herself really well in a planet, overflowing with guys. Allowing herself to get dictated by a group of men is simply not possible for her. Calico Jack Calico happens to really enjoy the women and is a relatively assured man. That is essentially it. In summary, I like what this game is offering players. Investing a number of hours trying to master every component of this game may possibly be the sole plan for me.